When SNL starts cracking jokes about the royals, it's probably because they made a big oops. Here's why William and Kate's family Christmas photo has everyone talking, and for all the wrong reasons. When Prince William and Kate Middleton shared their family's 2023 Christmas photo on Instagram, it's had many people accusing the Prince and Princess of Wales of photoshopping. Keen-eyed Instagram users also pointed out something strange about Louis's hand. One user wrote, Anyone talking about why Prince Louis is just missing a finger? Many commented about the apparent Photoshop mishap, while others wondered how Meghan Markle, who has a rumored fraud relationship with Middleton, would respond to the family photo. William and Kate never fessed up to doctoring the Christmas card, but they were reportedly embarrassed that people implied they edited the pic, as an insider told Us Weekly. Not long after, Saturday Night Live took shots at the Prince and Princess of Wales. Colin Jost said during the Weekend Update segment, A Christmas photo released by the royal family features a bad Photoshop job, where Prince Louis's finger appears to be missing. While showing an illustration of Meghan giving a blurred out middle finger, Jost then quipped, and this is sweet. Meghan Markle said she has a finger they can use if they need it. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle no longer post on social media, since leaving their roles with the royal family. But they did send out a Christmas card via email. The electronic card was more formal than Prince William and Kate Middleton's, and featured a photo of the couple attending the Invictus Games earlier in the year. The e-card highlighted their work with the Archwell Foundation, and included a link to their website. When news of the Sussex's Christmas card spread online, some users on X put forth the theory that Harry and his wife intentionally sent it out at the same time as his brother and sister-in-law. One posted, Harry and Meghan release a video showing Archwell annual impact. Come on, who's copying who? Another wrote, apparently they released it to show up Kate. We're a fantastic team, we know we are. Rumors continued to swirl on December 18th when Kate posted a throwback photo to Instagram from when she enjoyed Christmas as a youngster in 1983. Kate wrote in the caption, Sharing some festive memories this Christmas because shaping us is all about the vital importance of our early years. A few followers believed that this post was a subtle jab at Meghan. They were referencing details that came out in the book about the royals that illustrated the icy relationship between Kate and Meghan. While Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle were not known to be very very close, the book Endgame by Royals expert Omid Scobie showed just how fractured the relationship between the two women was. Scobie wrote in the book, There was a hope that Kate would be someone she could at least turn to. Kate, however, was uninterested in forming this kind of bond with Meghan. Not only did Kate fail to reach out to her sister-in-law, but according to the author, she also openly mocked Meghan to others. Scobie wrote, She spent more time talking about Meghan than talking to her. As originally published, the Dutch translation of Scobie's book reportedly named then Prince Charles and Kate as two members of the royal family who were concerned about what Prince Archie's skin color would be when Meghan was pregnant with him. This accusation upset both King Charles and Kate. A royal Insider told InTouch on December 15th, it was humiliating for Kate that Harry and Meghan would allegedly accuse her of something so horrific. A sliver of good news did come out of the whole ordeal, though, as Kate reportedly extended an olive branch to her sister-in-law. A source told InTouch, shortly after the book's allegations came out, Kate reached out to Meghan to clear the air. The insider also said Charles was the one who wanted Kate and Meghan to settle their differences. The source revealed to InTouch, he wants to heal the rift once and for all. 